quite ugly inside TV at the pub afterwards. A DIY job, we got the uh, the phone on top of a pint glass here. So, uh, Clive, 3 2 Southampton, much needed, and we see a lot of smiling faces after the match today. Yeah, I'm delighted. That, that really gives us a chance to go forward now. It, it was when it getting to the stage of our last chance, but we d at least we did take it today. Mm. And we were positive, you know, having gone 1 0 down, showed a little bit of character. But I have to say that the goals were real top quality today. They they were. Really. And, you know, Mario Lamina's equaliser was straight out of the top draw. Nobody saw that coming. When it when it was hit, it weren't going anywhere else apart that top corner. No, that's right. Um, and, and thank God for that, because that, that got us back in. And then within five minutes or so, you know, you've gone 2-1 up and the whole game's turned on its head. And it's, it's just, it's just, that's the way these games go. And do you know what? As I said all along, we're going to have to do it on the road. And that's gonna, it's going to be a roller coaster between now and the end of the season. And you've just got to go with it and you've got to be positive. But please, please, manager, be confident as well because those guys can do it. The players can do it, you know. But if you don't give them direction to be positive, then we retreat like we did when it was 3-2. It yeah. got really, really hairy because we haven't won for so long. And that gets in your head. And today was the trouble. When, when we haven't won for so long, yeah. it gets in your head and you're thinking... When are West Brom going to equalise? You know, and thank and it was it was a roller coaster this afternoon. You know, I, I said to somebody else, you know, it was a bit of a nervous sandwich this afternoon. West Brom go up four minutes in yeah. a free header, and then they score quite late on from a, another header. Yeah, yeah, I know, and, and then that's hit the post and gone in. See, there's no way you're keeping it out, and then it, and then it becomes the last. But I guess we dealt with. I don't know where he got five minutes of injury time, but we dealt with that quite well at the end. Um, so it's a positive day for Saints mm. we can take this forward uh, obviously you look at the fixture list and it's not very kind to us and some of the games that we play away from home against uh, the opponents around us they're going to be the games that yeah. define whether Saints stay in the Premiership or we get relegated it's a big month it's of March step, it, it's a big step forward today mm. it's a big step forward this has given us a chance and what, what did you make of Jack Stevens third goal in three games yeah Jack Stevens coming up with the goods and and uh, James Walprow's coming up with the goods yeah. so and everyone was fighting for that ball when uh, they were about to place it yeah they were and, and Buffo had a little strop but it went in the net mm. I'm not sure if Foster should have saved that it was a slightly slow going down but who cares? We've we've got the three points. It gives us a chance. Yeah. Liverpool at home next week. Well, I don't know. With Liverpool, sometimes they're amazing. They blast you away. But there's no reason why we can't have a go. But the main thing is, in all these games, we have to think positive. We've got good players out there. We have to take games to the opposition. If you do that, it's it's all about what's up there. If you do that and the fans think that you can stay up, mm. that's important. Mm. The fans think that you can stay up, we've got a decent chance. And the, the win today obviously gives a lot of belief back to the fans today. You know, it, it takes us now up to 14th in the league, moving us away from 20th, which is where we've left West Brom. But I, I think we should be looking up the table and, you know, Bournemouth four points away in ninth. Yeah, of course we should. But you just, this league's crazy. This league's crazy. It can turn on its head in two or three games. Let's just be happy. We've got the three points today. Let's look forward to the Liverpool game and fans just give it everything you've got next week because, you know, how much do we like Liverpool? Mm. Eh? Come on, guys. Give it some.